Hey, what's up YouTube, it's Forster5150 here, and we're actually here to go ahead and do an update on the HP Omen and some of the heat issues we had before. I did a repaste and I wanted to let people know how everything was running. I do apologize, I haven't uploaded anything in a while uh, for the last month. I've been doing things like photography and stuff like that, and I may be starting another channel uh, working with the photography and uh, if you're interested in that, definitely let me know in the comments below and I'll let you, I'll see if I'll, you know, just give a uh, shout out in the next video I do. Anyway, uh, we're gonna go ahead and do Rise of the Tomb Raider because that is a little bit heavy. I wanted to uh, pick a, you know, heavy game that's, you know, pretty graphics demanding that's going to bring up the temperatures a lot more than, you know, some of the other games. Uh, if running with this, we should definitely see uh, if we have any changes from, you know, some of the last times that we, we played on this uh, laptop, I think we'll definitely have a idea of how well the thermal paste worked uh, after. So far, you know, my personal opinion, just without showing you anything, is that it definitely helped. It definitely helped this laptop a lot. You know, ever since I've done that, you know, the performance has been up. I've been probably about 15 to 20, uh, you know, degrees Celsius in my just everyday workloads. Uh, like, if I show you now here, right now I'm downloading the update to Tomb Raider, so... Um, for some reason that I don't know why that's there. But you can see I'm at 51 uh, Celsius. And we bring up the uh, Omen Command Center. There's a new update for it now. It tracks your game time and stuff like that. I really don't like that, but I decided to let it go anyway, just because. Uh, let's see here, we got to uh, agree to all these things now. Yeah, see this is the uh, the game data and stuff like that. And we'll just go ahead and agree to those. So right now I'm at 64, and that's after running uh, the updates and stuff like that. And I mean, that's a little high, but that's way lower than it was before. Before it was going into the 70s under, you know, when it's actually working. Because right now, I mean, the CPU is not being utilized, but a lot of stuff is going on, like the hard drive and stuff like that. So there's a lot of heat going on in the laptop. So I'll go ahead and get to you right when this uh, gets done downloading. We're gonna start up some Tomb Raider just to see how our, uh, our temps are. So here we go. I'm going to use my controller because uh, laptop. <laughs> I don't have my mouse and keyboard right now. Um, where usually I'll just use my regular mouse on here. But uh, we're gonna go ahead and see. Right now we're at 72, and it's gonna tell me there's a bunch of extra stuff like that, and I'm not really interested in that. Um, let's just actually go in the game. And, and see what we have. We can see, I'm, I'm seeing that like 80s, 70s and 80s. Uh, before, we definitely had, you know, 100 degrees Celsius. We were always in the 90s. Like always, there, there was no dipping into the 90s. It was just 90s and then, you know, right to 100. And then it would just throttle down. All right, so here we go. We got uh, a spot that I didn't get really too far on. <laughs> But this is not bad here. Uh, if I remember where I was. But right now, yeah, you can see we're at in the 70s. Uh, before... The box could be here. Oh, I forgot about this. Before we were, you know, at it's 90 so already. Shock, we were 96, 97. You know, right now we're in the 80s. And this is a pretty, you know, graphic intensive game. So I have no idea what I'm actually doing here. This is more of a, a just to see what we got going on. Just to give it a little bit of a graphic boost. But that's not bad. I mean, before, like I said, before we were running a really high frame per second, or before we were running a really high uh, heat, uh, our Celsius was 100 and it just wouldn't go down. It wouldn't go under 90. It was impossible to do that. So let's go ahead and uh, do a benchmark. I go to main menu. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, take a look at the options. 
uh, graphics and stuff like that. And we're at the highest right now. So if you're wondering, the highest preset, uh, 1080p, of course, because we're using you know this regular monitor, uh, the monitor that's included, no V-Sync. And uh, let's go ahead and run the benchmark. Now, as far as the frames per second, remember there's gonna be a little bit more, because I'm running OBS in the background on the laptop uh, and that's going to decrease your, you know, FPS that you're going to going to get, as well as you know it does increase a little bit of the heat and stuff like that because more CPU is being used. But we're just going to take a look at the, uh, you know, the heat that we're getting out of here. And now a lot of people were asking about the uh, the thermal paste being added to your your lap. Now, if you add your own thermal paste, it's not really going to void your warranty. A lot of people worry about that. And I, I encourage you to look in you know, at the laws in your own country. But in like the United States, if you repair your own laptop or any type of electronic equipment, it does not void your warranty. It's actually illegal for companies to do that. Uh, to avoid it because you uh, went in and you know repaired it unless your repair or whatever you did is the direct reason why you need that warranty that's the only reason way they can deny it uh, if there's water damage to your laptop or something else then that's going to be a completely different story but it's not going to have to do with you know the thermal paste that you add and now seeing that we're in the gaming mode it's going to run hotter now this is the max heat that it's going to be able it's going to run at it's going to kick up the fans it's going to try to keep your megahertz in a reasonable range but as you can see we're sitting at around 80 85 again and yeah i mean this is way way better than it was before uh it, was, it should jump over 90 in this mode but it's not i mean we're at 80 it should definitely go higher than that yeah see in the 70s so that's pretty much all I wanted to show everybody today is just, you know, how much more that you're going to get out of this if you repaste your laptop. And I, I do plan on doing a video that's directly related to the, um, you know, the warranty laws and stuff like that. If there's anything I have that I want you guys to recognize, I'm going to stop this, is that the, war the warranties, don't be afraid of the warranty when you need to repair your laptop. I mean, they do have, uh, you know, tricky wording in there and stuff like that. Like if you bang something up while you're repairing it um, and they'll try to get it, get you for that. But in general, repairing your own laptop, putting thermal paste on your laptop, it's not going to void your warranty. A lot of people worry about that and, and reasonably so. But anyway, uh, let me know what you guys think about this. Uh, this is after the repaste and it's been a few months. So I want to let you guys know that it's still running well. This is after, after it's been sitting there. I've been using the, I used the Arctic um, 13 or Arctic, Arctic 5 uh, thermal compound and it works amazingly. Uh, I use it on my, my regular uh, CPU and I, th I think we've done a great deal of improvement on the performance for this laptop. I also want to say thank you everybody out there that has been uh, commenting on the old videos for the laptop, uh, the repaste, the uh, heat issues one, and I, I try to get to everybody. Sometimes I don't, and I do apologize if I haven't. Every time I hear that you guys use the guide and you had successful stories, I love hearing that. I, I really appreciate hearing about it and I'm glad I was able to help. Anyway, I wanna thank everybody for watching this video. Make sure you hit that like button and definitely subscribe if you're new to the channel. I'll have more videos coming up soon. You all take care and happy gaming.